Hello. It has been a time. Getting things figured out with um, East Coast stuff is um, so worth it, I find. So um, thank you for being patient and flexible. Hello, Milan. Hello to my guest. Yay. I'm going to send the little invite. Hi. Hi. How are hey, you? our rooms are like the same color so right weird. now. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Can you hear me okay? I love that. So the MTA was just absolutely horrendous. It was nuts. I actually had like a, a, a first meeting of somebody that I met on Lex um, on, a dating uh -huh. on a dating app today. And like, it was like, <laughs> it was supposed to be a half hour. It took an hour and 10 minutes. Then I, wow. had, then I made my friend's show with like a minute to spare, which was amazing. But then coming back to do this, my, uh -huh. I get on the train. I'm like, all right, I'll be there in 15 minutes. It's going to be great. And then the train stopped and then there was no oh. train for a half hour. And I was like, oh. it's like physically too long to walk to where I need to go. And I was like, I'm stuck. Right. And then that train skipped the stop I was supposed to do. This is just nuts. Let me see if I can put on a little more light here so you can oh, see. Oh, man. Yeah. It was nuts. What you got to do. Hell yeah. Absolutely. Hi. Oh, there we go. Hi. My fancy <laughs> lighting. What's up? Oh, my God. It's all my favorite people. Yay. I have all favorite Isn't that people. the best? It's so good. I love that. So you have a little in parentheses, Mia? Yes. Is that how, how you pronounce it? Okay. Yeah. Okay, cool. Got it. I wanted to make sure oh, you're good. that 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 I understood that right. Mm -hmm. No, it's cool. that's why I've been like, my guest. Huh. You know, even like people don't necessarily know how my name is spelled, which is really funny. <laughs> like, or, or how it's pronounced. So I, I just put that yeah. in parentheses. But then that confuses people because they, everybody pronounces, and I've talked to other people who are named Mia or Maya no matter what the spelling is, because honestly, the cool thing about my name is that it means the same thing in almost every language, um, right. but it's spelled either with a Y or an I or two A's and a Y or M-A-I-A -A or something like that. And so, but every single person I've known who is named Mia or Maya that nobody ever pronounced it right. You know, if they're named <laughs> Mia, they pronounce it, somebody pronounces it Maya. You know, it's just, it's the way, it's the way people, English speakers are terrible, frankly. <laughs> Let's be real. I hate capitalism and English speakers are terrible. And I'm one of them. So self-hate. Yeah. It's good. <laughs> I'm just kidding, friends. Oh. Well, cool. So would you prefer to go first or would you prefer for me to go first? I'm happy to go first. Um, if that's okay, cool. All right. Yeah. Awesome. Already. I've been thinking about life, life. I've been thinking about friends of mine. Thinking about sunshine beating down. Reminiscing on the old days, adjusting to the new ways. Thinking about heartaches coming around. I've been thinking about the lion. I've been thinking about dying. And redemption in all its shapes. Thinking about my lovers. Everything I have discovered. When I look to the sky and I pray. But if you don't want to grow older, better keep it moving. There's so much to take. On leap of faith, I've been thinking about the sunshine coming high on the horizon. Even in bad times, it don't fade. Some will sit in this illusion, some will say it's an illusion. 
explosion. To take what you need to survive some more. But if your heart is in the right place, it don't matter in the first place where you come from, where you are. But if you don't want to go there, you're stuck inside the stale air. It's all right to be scared as long as you ain't afraid. I've been thinking about sunshine coming out of the horizon. Even in bad times, it don't pay. Heard there was a tale. She sewed cause words failed her. And in between the stitches, she found her star. Come through a window. What a funny thing to find though. When you look up, you see so far. But if you don't wanna go there, and you feel like you're the honor there, like a rusty gutter. In the pouring rain, try to think about the sunshine coming high on the horizon. Even in bad times, it don't fade. I've been thinking about the sunshine coming high on the horizon. Even in bad times, it don't fade. It don't fade. hope it came through uh, okay i'm like on i'm on like lte tethered internet i'm traveling it's hard yeah i get you it mostly did it broke up a little bit but i've heard from people that on the um the igtv um repost it tends to come through fine awesome <laughs> that is what i've heard but it was, oh my your playing God. came through great. You're such an amazing player. Your Thank voice you so is much. awesome. And your lyrics are great. Aw, everybody's hearting everything. They're the whole package. It's just such a good feeling. It's a really good feeling. Oh, I'm uh, so happy you're all here. Yeah. How was Americana Fest? It was pretty awesome. Yeah. It was really, really, really awesome. Khaki, hi to your hi to your hi to your baby. Hello, it's so nice to meet you all. Um it was so good. Robin, thank you for the compliment. Um, thank you, James. Um, it was so good. Um, I was kind of surprised. I'd sort of been girding myself to have a terrible, terrible time because I'd heard tell from other queer and trans friends of mine who tried to attend in uh, many years ago that they've gotten a lot of pushback and a lot of like weird shit had happened. But, mm. um, you know, there's a thing that happens, you know, because people, a lot of people, you know, I have a reputation like uh, uh, in, in the Americana world, you know, so mm. I got treated with a lot of respect, which was like really not, nobody was like, oh, and she's trans or like, oh, and like, Blah, 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 blah. People were like super cool. And they're like, my God, you're a good songwriter and an excellent guitar player. You should come hang out with me. Hey, let's hang out. Hey, you want a hug? Hey, want everybody, want everybody dinner? Damn, you're, you're cool. You should move to Nashville. All this stuff. It was like completely surprising. And I felt very welcomed. And, and, you know, people knew it was important that I was there, but they didn't make a big deal out of, out of and they didn't other me. It was just wonderful. And the music was unbelievably good. And I, I've met so many musicians I've never heard of. It was just a fantastic time. That's wonderful. I love hearing that. It's very special. Um, I grew up in Nashville a little bit. So mm -hmm. it's like extra special to hear that it was so good to you. <laughs> yeah, it felt really good. And, and yeah, Robin, it, I'm, I'm glad you liked that. You know, I, I, one of the things I was saying all weekend was... Um, 
I really hope that my being there and being out, because there, were, there, were, there weren't any other out trans women that I met when I was there. There, there were a couple of trans men, but really there were no other out trans women there. And so it was cool to be there, but it was also kind of like, it was a little isolating in, in a certain way, but not, you know, in the sense that I didn't, you know, I just want more people to come out in Americana and I want there to be more trans folks in Americana who feel comfortable being there because it's our genre. You know, I know too many people from, who are queer and or weird gendery kind of folks who are like, I, there's no space for me in like, you know, the, the canon of American music and I should do pop or I should do synth wave or I should do like, you know, mm -hmm. whatever. I'm like, no, do the music that moves you. But the most wonderful thing about Americana Fest was Black Opry. Um, yeah. It's really, it was, it was wonderful to see all of these black country musicians coming together in one place and like finding each other. And then to be, it was a really intersectional house um, that went down and so, said like, I was there, there were some other trans folks there and it was totally intersectional and really cool. And it was nice to be part of this thing and, you know, have all of these lines that, you know, divide the working class be just like shattered, even for a day, for all of us to just be there making music with each other. That's the best thing. That's amazing. That sounds like such a, an incredible environment. Thank you so much for sharing about that. That was so good no to problem. hear. And as Robin just said, you're inspiring the crap out of folks. Inspiring the crap out of me too. Yeah, it's like, you know, I'm like x lax but for your brain. Yeah. <laughs> terrible, I'm a terrible person. I should just learn to take compliments instead of like being like, ha ha ha, here's a funny quip, because I'm pretty quick, but yeah. Are you gonna play us a song? Yeah, I'm gonna play a song. It's funny, um, the title of the song I'm playing um, is Your Way Home. And that was before I knew, before any of the transit issues went down. <laughs> so <laughs> I was awesome. like, oh, that was oddly prescient, I guess. It's it funny. was like full on Mercury retrograde today. It was crazy. <laughs> anyway, I'm so excited <laughs> to hear you sing. Oh, thank you. This is, um, yeah, this is a song about just like self-love and all that all that stuff it's kind of short too here you go be good to your girl and i have sought the fields with her father with big blooms to gather to bring home to you wise Ooh. Be kind to your heart, he's been beating all out of rhythm, it's time to forget him, it's time that you moved on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. She's been wrapped up, says a curled rip, waiting for you to get to untie the bow. Be wise with your word, they can shackle, burn down your castle, or they can build temple. Make them your way home. Of your eyes, they've been fooling themselves. 
They keep fooling themselves. They keep thinking they see is real, but they don't know what it is. You know. Yay. Oh my god, I love that melody. Thank you. It's a really good one. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Oh, thank you. So, what do you have to plug? Because I know I definitely want to hear more of you. And I'm um, sure that others do. Well, you should all uh, sign up for my YouTube uh, which is uh, YouTube slash my name, uh, my name, Mia Burn Music. Um, and also, I have a Patreon uh, where I post new songs every Monday. I write a new song every week. There are hundred, wow. there are over a hundred songs on this page, um, and some of them turn into songs on my. I'm recording new album. Well, I just recorded a new album. It's getting mixed right now, um, but almost all of those songs came from came from my new song Monday's page. So it's patreon.com slash Mia Burn Music. I'll just throw that into the chat real quick. Yeah, yeah, um, do that. But yeah, um, <laughs> Patreon. Uh, James says, definitely get on that Patreon. It's it's really cool because um, I I really don't like I really don't like posting. Uh, I mean, like, it might seem like I'm really good at the social media game, but I really just like, you know, the thing about my relationship with my digital cameras, it's made me like photography again. So with Instagram, uh, I'm, really, I'm really, it's really evolved about the photography, for, photography aspect for me. So um, with my Patreon, I find myself lately kind of sometimes using it to just actually like communicate with, with the people that I'm, you know, making music for, which is kind of nice. And, you know, it ebbs and flows, but I, I would love more subscribers just because it's, it's nice. It's my accountability group, basically. Um, yeah. And it's super great. But um, yeah, uh, I'm playing in New York at the Knitting Factory playing guitar for Paisley Fields tomorrow night. If you're in town, come to the Knitting Factory. Ryan Casada is also playing. It's gonna be really cool. And then, um, uh, yeah, just get in touch with me. I'm a nice person. <laughs> Say hi. You can follow Mia too on right here on this platform. Check out the photography. Stay updated. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. That would make you a real <laughs> lifesaver. <laughs> <laughs> I went to the store. I saw lifesavers butter rum, which I haven't bought in I was like, oh my god, I need them right now. Those are so good. Right. That's the best kind. I don't know why anyone would buy any other kind. I should start an Instagram series where I just eat candy. It's, it would be yes. really fun. I mean, I could just review candy. Yeah, why not, you know? <laughs> If you don't know me already, you should know that. It's the please. content we need. Mia Burn eats candy for you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I love it. What do you got coming up? Well, I'm just doing a lot of um, mixing of my own stuff. Oh, wonderful. That's kind of a journey that I'm on just I have been for the past few years but I have a commitment I'll announce it here that before the end of the year I want to have mixed all of my 30-ish songs that I have um, recorded in some form and um, to do it mostly myself with the help of some mentors and stuff so that's a huge deal that's wonderful. Yeah. Thank you. And um, yeah, I have Trinidad Escobar and I have a um, duo called Blue Ghosts. So you can um, check that Instagram out as well. That's kind of the main 
space that we occupy right now. Um, but uh, you can see some art that um, she has made inspired by some of our lyrics to our songs and um, just watch that space because I'm fairly certain that the next thing that I release will be under Blue Ghosts. Right on. Well, that's what's going on. And yeah. And then I have this. You could watch this on YouTube, all the past ones. And, um, you know, if you feel like tuning in, I do this every Thursday, usually at 930 Pacific, unless I have an honored East Coast guest, in which you, case and, I... Or, or a West Coast guest who happens to be on the East Coast. True. <laughs> yeah. Or that. But yeah. Awesome. Oh man, this has been a freaking blessing. This is you what should, I needed today. Yeah, and you should check out Robin Shakedown. She's all she's always posting cool stuff and uh working working on the stuff she's doing uh, pretty transparently on on her Instagram, which really is very cool and not a lot of people do that like showing the process publicly. So that's amazing. Well, mm -hmm. I saw that you followed me, Robin. Definitely going to follow you back. Um, would have followed you <laughs> had you not followed me first, based on that ringing endorsement as well. Aw. <laughs> cool. I'm so glad so, right. so many of my friends tuned in that I, haven't, that I miss a lot. I miss you all a lot, those of you who haven't Aww. seen in a while. If you're in New I'm York... I'm glad you. If you're in New York and uh, you you think I'm too busy to hang out with you, you're wrong. <laughs> so, like, just put, <laughs> hit me up. I would love to see you. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you so much, Mia. Thank you. And what a pleasure. I'll let you get to bed. It's so late there. <laughs> oh, oh, it's only 1122. There's still like four hours of, of hanging out left to do. That's not true. I'm not going to, I'm not going to go out tonight. I might make myself a sleep. <laughs> All right. I'll talk to you soon. Thank you. All right. Yeah. Thank you so much. Good night, everybody. Bye.